Hello friends, let's solve this Olympiad problem. What's given in this problem? We'll see solve root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x plus root of 2 minus root 3 whole to the power of x. So now we'll just consider this problem. is equal to 4. Just consider root 2 plus root 3 into 2 minus root 3 will give you how much we'll see. It's equal to 4 minus of a, a plus b into a minus b form it is. That is a plus b into a minus b can be written as a square minus b square. So this can be written as 4 minus root 3 whole square which is equal to 4 minus 3 which is equal to 1. That means you are having 2 plus root 3. If you are taking root for the whole thing over here in this way it is equal to root of 1 which is equal to 1. So, therefore, this is nothing but root of 2 plus root 3 into 2 minus root 3 under root here is equal to 1. So, now we are going to divide it to, on both sides with root of 2 plus root 3. So, you are going to get it as root of 2 plus root 3 into root of 2 minus root 3 divided by root of 2 plus root 3 which is equal to 1 by root of 2 plus root 3. I divide it by root of 2 plus root 3 on both sides. So, we cancel this. So, what are we getting here? 2 minus root 3 under root can be written as 1 by root 2 plus root 3. Okay. We will take this as equation 1. So now here you are having this is the given problem. What is the given problem? We will see root of 2 plus root 3 plus whole power x plus root of 2 minus of root 3 whole power x is equal to 4. This is the given problem for us. You can see this. So we will take this as equation 2. So now substituting. equation 1 in equation 2 we get root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x plus now root of 2 minus root 3 is written as 1 by root of 2 plus root 3 so this you can write it as 1 by root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x is equal to 4 now this you can write this as root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x plus 1 to the power of x divided by root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x which is equal to 4 and this can be written as root 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x plus 1 to the power of x is always 1, 1 to the power of anything is 1 isn't it so therefore we write it as 1 by root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x is equal to 4 the equation we got so let us consider root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x is equal to u so if substituting this in the equation you get u plus 1 by u is equal to 4 or you can write this as u square plus 1 is equal to 4 u right so you will get it in that way then you can also write this as u square minus 4 u plus 1 is equal to 0 so now here you are going to get this you have to find out what is the root of this or factorize this so we know that this factorization is equal to here you can factorize it by writing that u is equal to minus b plus or minus root of b square minus 4ac by 2a so in this equation what is a a is equal to 1 b is equal to minus 4 c is equal to 1 so substituting in this you get two values for u that is u can be written as minus of minus 4 that is plus 4 plus or minus root of b square is minus 4 whole square minus of 4 into 1 into 1 divided by 2 into 1 
so this can be written as u is equal to you getting two values so 4 plus or minus root of 4 square is 16 minus of 4 divided by 2 so which is equal to you getting u is equal to 4 plus or minus root of 12 divided by 2 so now we can write this as 4 plus or minus root of 4 into 3 divided by 2 so this can be written as 4 plus or minus 2 root of 3 divided by 2 so when you are dividing it separately you are going to get it as 4 by 2 plus or minus 2 root 3 by 2 so this will get cancelled and here you will get it as 2 so you are getting u is equal to 2 plus or minus root 3 so you are getting two values in case 1 and case 2 what are we getting we will see you are getting u is equal to 2 plus root 3 and one more you are getting u is equal to 2 minus of root 3 now what is u equal to we have considered u as what we have put here u is equal to what is the value of u we will see here here I put u is equal to root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x. So 2 plus root 3 under root whole to the power of x is equal to 2 plus root 3. Now we know that root of 2 plus root 3 whole square if you are taking it will be equal to nothing but 2 plus root 3 because the root will get cancelled. This, this and this will get cancelled. So therefore you are going to get it as 2 plus root 3. So therefore you can write this as root 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x is equal to root of 2 plus root 3 whole square. So therefore since the base is equal over here you can you will get x is equal to 2. Now considering the second case what we have we have that root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x is equal to 2 minus root 3. Now we know that 2 minus root 3 is written as 1 by root of or this can be written as root of 2 whole square. So this is can be written as root of 2 plus root 3 whole square we got. So therefore this is root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x is equal to this. Therefore this can be written as root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of x is equal to root of 2 plus root 3 whole to the power of minus 2. Since the base is equal, you are getting x is equal to minus 2. So, our solution is x is equal to 2. The solution is x is equal to 2, x is equal to minus 2.